Hertog. It's showing off? Yeah. Can you ask him where we are? Where are we? Hertog, wo sind wir jetzt? In Lahnstein. Lahnstein? Yeah. What is your favourite part of Kettering? Perhaps uh, the restaurant Bock. Bock, Kettering Bock. Oh. 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 Danke. Some sort of Kettering demon. Kettering devil? A Kettering demon nearby. That seems offensive. That, that can't be what he meant, right? It's not really a Kettering devil, is it? Maybe he was talking about you. You just went for devil immediately seems and guessed like it. You're supposed to know German. Huh? That's your job. I know German. Well, what was Bock? I know all of the German. You said to me you were fluent in German. I said I knew German? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't say I knew every German word. You suggest to me you're not fluent in English if you're telling me you're fluent in German. Well, I don't think I know every English word either, do you? I know, I know what fluent means. Emma? Yeah? What's bock in German? Uh, I think it's a moose. A moose? Okay. That sounds mad. A moose. Huh? There you go. She actually knows the word. She's not even, she's a runner. Kettering moose. Devil. I was heading to Lahnstein, Germany. Twin town of Kettering, Northamptonshire, where I grew up. I wanted to experience firsthand the glorious bond between the place I call home and this mysterious foreign place full of strangers. This is Sweet Home, Lahnsteiner Ringer. In 1700, a wall was built around Lahnstein and a family actually lived inside part of that wall. In 2016, their home has been turned into a little museum known as the Town Wall Lodge. Local guide, Mr. Guile, agreed to show us around. Please note, I had fired Jack as translator and replaced him with Emma, whose German was infinitely better than her predecessor. Like a, a roller coaster. Perfect. Ja, Berg oder Hügel? Na, für Wasser? Kettle for water. As soon as we set foot in the town wall lodge, I knew it was going to be full of surprises. Yes, what have you said? The places still make potato cake in Lahnstein. Could I buy some potato cake? Only November. Was liest diese Mutter? What is this mother reading? She, uh, at the moment she, leaves, she reads the Bible. Ah, oh, the Bible. The Bible. But we have also uh, books which uh, were written by Lahnsteiner people, Joe Junke. He, he, he write about a thousand different Western romance. And James, are you hoping for your own Western romance? In Germany? Maybe. I wouldn't rule it out. Is there lovely ladies like this in Lahnstein who would like to talk to me? Uh, ask her. She's got four kids. Hello. James, sit down. So, go on, James. Start the date. It's a mother of four reading the Bible. Just your type. Where did you get that headscarf? Stuff like that? I like your shawl. It feels weird when her baby's in her lap, talking to her. Home writer. Um. Can James kiss her? Yes, please. Kiss her. <laughs> I won't kiss her. We go upstairs to a bedroom. Kiss her hand. I'm yeah, not kissing no. anything here. Okay. They all look strange. Just a little kiss. Mm. A little peck on the cheek. <laughs> That's the worst one to kiss. Now that love was in the air, we decided to visit the Witch's Tower. 
originally built to imprison the witches of the town, these days the tower is used for civil ceremonies, and many have tied the knot there. We have about 10,000 men in lunchtime, <laughs> and there will be one for here. Wow. Uh, a busy week. Yeah. On any country. James, would you like to get married in somewhere like Landstein? Yes. Yeah? Get me shot the guns. Yes. If you don't like your wife anymore, <laughs> shoot her in the head. Lose <laughs> them or you throw her in the dungeon. <laughs> the witch's tower was not as romantic as I'd hoped, so we moved on to St. James's Chapel a more traditional setting for my potential wedding to a German mannequin. Considering getting married here, James? I wouldn't say no. <laughs> here you I have don't... much more room. Yes. For your visitors of the wedding. Yeah, loads more visitors. Here about 100 people can look here for your wedding. The choir can mm. sing from... from I mean, the only person who's sitting there now is the one person I wouldn't invite. And the all pilgrims who went to Santiago had such a scale of shell, all have to wait. Today oh, also. And, and this pilgrim died here, and they uh, made him a grave. Look who slithered down from the balcony. What do you think your job is in this crew at the moment? Fixer. Not the fixer. You were meant to be the translator and you messed it up. So yeah. now you're a runner. I wanted to go home and you said I had to stay. Yeah, well, yeah. Yeah, you had to stay. Because we can't, we're not going to pay for you another trip home. You're going to go on the trip home that we, you, you are booked on, which is the same as the rest of us. You're not going to go home early. And you're not a fixer now. What do you get some ice cream? Yeah, I you're meant that. to get some ice cream. Well, you were meant to do it. No, I'd love that. Like it, like I think it's your job. Ice cream, and I was like, yes, please. Yeah. Yeah, but you're the one who's meant to go and get them, Jack. So you want me to fix the ice creams? Jack's shenanigans were beginning to take their toll. Would you like us to get you some ice cream? Standing in the chapel, I wondered if the boy had been sent to test me. Ice cream. No. But concluded, probably not. <coughs> Either way, we did not get any ice cream that day. Yes, please. Yes, sir. <laughs> Got my binoculars ready to go. Anyone else be getting a text from iTunes asking me to send them all their details? Yeah, yeah, yeah.